Okay, this this song just came up, Marigolds. Now, I've been following Dimash now for mm, three years. And I don't think I've ever heard this song before. So, um, let's listen to it, yeah? All right. Одна из моих самых любимых песен на украинском языке. Специально для вас черного кривцы. Yeah. 
Wow. All right, I took a little peek. It said uh, March 11th. No, I, I wasn't sure if this was in the Ukraine. It said this was his favorite Ukraine song. But then the audience started to sing, and I was like, okay, he's in the Ukraine on, on this date. has to be. What was more powerful than the beautiful song itself was how it touched his mom. I almost started to tear up just watching his mom. He sang that song to his mom. And Svetlana, she... Such a beautiful woman at her age. Just beautiful. And uh, what an amazing tribute to both the Ukrainian people that he sang in front of and his mom. And they reciprocated that love back. What an amazing four minutes and 38 seconds that was. Wow. Like I said, I, I probably won't remember the song too much. It was a good song. And um, what I'll remember is how it affected his mom. Wow. Sometimes songs don't have to take years or days to write. Sometimes they can take only 10, 20 minutes. Sometimes the best songs are written in a short period of time. You just have it. It was emotionally sensitive at that time. And some of these songs turn out to be fantastic hits. When I think of an emotional song that was written for somebody like that, it's not really associated with Dimash. There was a singer by the name of, um, oh, what's his name? I'll have to get back to you now. I just, uh, this is David something. And, uh, David. And, um, he was on American Idol. That'll help. He won. And he had a brother that was dying of brain cancer. And he wrote a song, and it was like in 10 minutes. And it turned out to be his best song he ever wrote, even to this day. And, uh, yeah those emotional heartbreaker ones because it just it's it's amazing yeah uh, sometimes simplicity is really really beautiful this didn't have like high notes or this was a song that everyone could sing to that was Ukrainian that could speak the language um, this was A plus Peace out. If you can remember that American Idol guy's name, let me know. I forget.